Imagine you have a jigsaw puzzle, but all the pieces fit but one. You're confused because they all came out of the same box. And no matter what you do, you cannot find where that last piece goes. It doesn't fit anywhere. That's how it can be when you have one or more kids to say, you're an amazing parent. But you got that one narcissistic adult child who can't stand your guts. You're confused because you're like, they all pretty much grew up in the same environment. You even made it your mission to say, I don't play favorites. And when the one child goes to defend you and says, listen, don't listen to what they're saying. The narc child will tell you quick. Yeah, I would expect the little golden child to say something like that. It's no mystery. They've always been your favorite. But now I'm supposed to be grateful for the little crumbs that you give me, please. <laughs> but if you're really being honest, you probably gave far more to the adult narc child. Probably gave them far more attention because of all the guilt they made you feel about what a horrible parent you are. You tried to make it up to them in every way you could, but guess what? Never enough. However, your other child always still there, loving you, supporting you. And the first one to tell you their hate isn't your fault. You got to let it go. But the truth is loving a child who hates you is a burden no parent should have to bear. At the same time, you need to realize as a parent, your child is choosing to be the victim. Keyword choosing. And as a parent, we think we can fix anything, don't we? Or we want to, but you cannot control your child's will. But we can control how we choose to deal and hopefully heal. You're not the only one being impacted by the situation. All those who truly love you are suffering. While you're suffering, watching you suffer, and the only one who's enjoying the whole show, the puppet master of it all, is the narc adult child. It's time for you to practice some tough love and stop trying to repay a debt you don't owe, and one that will never be paid off. Instead, choose to invest in your healing and in the lives of those who actually care about you. Now, I can hear you saying, but doc, you're suggesting what? Let them go? Just take my hands off of them? Yes, that's what I'm suggesting. Let go and let God. Because you can't save them and you because this is killing you. So if you die and they laugh <laughs> and they're happy, who wins? Yeah, okay, it ain't worth it. So listen, I know it's hard. Here's what I want you to do because you're struggling with it. Go to my website, ChristopherReed.org. Schedule your free 30-minute consultation, right? So we can have a conversation. And I'm going to tell you how coaching is going to help you realize their pain is their choice. If you've enjoyed this video, please subscribe and share. Take care. Peace.